everybody. Welcome to Lump Vision. I go by the names Lump, D Lump, or LV. It doesn't matter which one you want to call me, I'll respond to any of them. Before I get started, I'd like to give a big shout out to all of my subscribers, old and new, and everybody who comes by and watches my channel. In today's video, I want to talk about the transition from a brush to a comb. Um, so, obviously, if you all been following me for a little bit, you know that I've cut my beard down and this uh, is going another couple of weeks. It'll be like three months since I made the cut. So, um, I try not to be, uh, try to throw numbers out there. You know, if I do, it's a range, like three to six months or or something like that, or six to eight months, or whatever the case is, something like that. But at the same time, I still don't want to lose the, um, the feeling when it comes to this thing here. For me, when it comes to growing a beard, there's a lot of feel to it. You just got to do something, and if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. If it does work, you know, it does work. Keep doing it. And, then, you know, for instance, so here we are with a comb, right? I have two combs, actually. This is the comb that I'm going to be using when I feel like it's necessary to use a comb. Currently, I'm still using a brush. Um, I think I can get away with using this comb. Um, this has like, this is a Chicago comb. I think this is like, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'll just put it up there once I figure out uh, what comb this is. Um, this is just your standard, you know, like a regular comb you would see in like a beauty supply store, but this is not a standard, weak, stupid plastic comb. Uh, this is carbon fiber, it's very sturdy. Uh, it's very, the edges and stuff are very smooth and it's a really good, sturdy, um, good comb and it doesn't cost you an arm and a leg to get this thing here. So that's this one. This is what I'm going to switch with and I'll show you in a second like why I think I can use it, but I just don't want to use it just yet. All right, so that's this comb and then I have this one for when the beer gets back to, the world, to where it was before. This is more of a, you know, this worked very well for me when I had like, you know, beer was kind of like down to here, you know, but this definitely is not gonna work currently, and I'll show you that as well. So, um, I figured maybe by January, like way back when I cut my beard, that I'd be using a comb like this by January, which I feel like I'm gonna be right, but um, yeah, so I still don't like to give a time frame. I just do stuff to see if it feels right. And if it feels right, I'll stick to it. If it's not, I'll just go back to whatever I was doing and just wait until it's time. So once again, the standard comb, right? It has the finer sides on this side and this is a little wider. Um, so I'll probably be using this comb for a minute because it has both sides, right? So brush, obviously a brush isn't really gonna do anything for me, for my journey to detangle. It's good for some places to style, especially the mustache. And it can be good for distributing oils over the top um, when it gets a little longer. But like I said, currently, I don't, I'm not really looking for any detangling just yet. Um, but just to show you that I probably could use this, right? Here's the finer side. So here's the finer side. It's going through, right? It's going through. It's super smooth. There isn't much resistance. And I actually, that's what I'm looking for. Just a little resistance. I, of course, I don't want this thing to be, you know, you know. <laughs> I don't want to be doing that, but I want some resistance because that resistance tells me that it, um, even though it's still smooth, I still want some resistance because I know in order to detangle, there's going to be, you know, a couple little pops here and there, a couple little snags here and there to, to let me know that I'm detangling my beard. So currently there's not much, and that's the finer side, currently there's not much resistance, so I don't really feel like I'm detangling anything. I'm just kind of going over it. That's the finer side. This is the, whatever you want to call it side, but the, obviously the teeth are wider and you can see that's a better shot. The teeth are wider on this side. So this is absolutely nothing. I'm just kind of like scratching my face, which is also good because you're exfoliating skin, uh, your skin just in case there's any dead skin or anything. So this can be used to exfoliate and stuff like that, you know, cause I am getting to a point, my beard is getting fuller. It's getting, you know, um, the beard oil and stuff will still easily get to my skin uh, and just I can still go like this too if I want to like scratch my skin if I think I need to. So this works sort of kind of so but I'm not ready for this just yet. And the big boy, this is going to do absolutely this is like 
absolutely nothing. It's just pointless to even have this thing out here. But I just wanted to show you that, you know, if you were thinking to make a purchase or anything like that, a comb like this at this length definitely, definitely is not going to work. A comb like this, possibly, possibly. Um, but I still think it's uh, um, a brush is still more suited for this length beard. And I'll just say it's getting close to three months because I know a lot of people say, hey, how long have you been growing your beard? And I'll, I never know because currently I didn't know because I would always uh, cut it or trim it really short or not like super short, but shorter than what it was. So I really didn't know how long I was growing that particular beard. I mean, I had multiple, really, I had multiple beards over the course of my journey from cutting it or trimming it low or just getting off dead, uh, split in, stuff like that. So I've had multiple beards. So if anybody wants to know about that question, I've actually haven't been clean shaven since I was probably in my mid twenties and I'm 40 years old. So I'm going to go around like 15, 16 years. I've had some sort of beard and I uh, haven't been clean shaven. So, uh, and I don't plan to ever, that's a horrible look for me and, uh, don't count on that ever happening. <laughs> and if I did shave, I may, you know, it'd be something here, you know, my, with the mustache, bare minimum mustache, but that's probably not going to happen. So this is probably my last cut unless, uh, I absolutely have to for whatever reason, but yeah, man, just wanted to jump on here real quick. Uh, it's been about a week since I've uploaded a video and uh it's you know i'm gonna try to continue to you know get on here and kind of go through uh, my transitions with you all and hopefully there's quite a few out there going through like a beginner stage to beer to something like this uh really soon so we're all grow together so that's my banner on my thing let's grow let's grow that's not like let's go it's more like let's grow let's grow together let's do it so that's it uh Monday, Monday's over for me, so I uh, hope you're all enjoying your Monday, um, hope the weekend was okay, so that's it, thanks for watching, questions, comments, concerns, let me know, later.